This is a big stasis module thingy. You're already dismembered-ish. I think we're safe with that. Can't move this other. They're, they're, they're too heavy. You can't, like, just walk through them and move them. Okay, security, security clearance required. required. One of these bad boys here. Loop and transmit to all personnel. This is Senior Medical Officer Nicole Brennan. Medical is overwhelmed. We need help. Look at his wounds. We can't handle so many trauma cases, and the command crew won't tell us what's happening. Maybe I have some PHP left. Hologram went over there, so follow it. Okay. But first... Ah, so I can take the thing out of here and put in the other one if I want to. And what will that do? It'll open up this. The ER hallway A. Alright, I'll consider that in a second. I can push this, huh? Oh no, I can just play this. I can uh, replay it, I see. Okay, let's see here. We can open up the shower. Turn off the lights, open up the shower, okay. Is a kinesis thing? Don't trust it. Medical log, Dr. Nicole Brennan. So much for being paranoid. I repurposed this room to run counseling sessions without unitologists interfering. Now it's the only place I feel safe. I recovered a limb after yesterday's attack. Genetically, it's human tissue with bizarre mutations, but it's just a sample. Not enough to figure out a cure. I need. Wait, where's that report from engineering? Oh, here. The engineers pulled something out of machinery. Limbs missing, torso intact. Okay. Time for a real autopsy. <laughs> So there was something going on, they knew about it, they thought it was some kind of disease or something, and they were able to... Well, they were able to, uh... do some testing and diagnosing and such. Okay, we can go that way. Did we... were we able to go over here? To the morgue. No, we weren't able to go over here before. Even when I turned the... this thing on. Because there's no option to turn on the door over here. Okay, so we'll just want to take this all out. Pretty sure I just healed myself on accident to full or use something. It. 
crap. Stuck. I could have gone better. Wish there were more throwy things in here. There it was. I couldn't find it earlier. Dang it. I was a little bit preoccupied with the things trying to kill me, you know? It doesn't open the other door, does it? Just that one? And just that one. Okay. You just know something's going to come alive in here. Like him. Gotcha. Thought he was dead. Well, we need a medical pack anyway, so there we go. I wonder if that counts as a sufficiently pointy object to impale somebody. Probably not. That does, though. I guess it was just that one shower that did that. Security request retrieved. He left me. I woke in the dark with them scratching in the walls. Scratching like rats. And you will log me in with them. Fuck it. I'll cut them out. I'll cut them out. I'll cut them out. Um...
I guess that's one way to go. I want my tossy throwy thing. Level two security clearance required. Where'd I put it? There it is. Did I get everything back here? No. Haven't been back here. Oh. Oh, shit. Where is it? Oh boy. There it was. I could couldn't find it in the chaos. Uh jeez. Panicking a bit too much to find it. Mercer, it's terrible. You were in surgery, so I left this with Warwick. He'll be discreet. I just got the latest report from Aegis 7. The situation's worse than Captain Matthias will admit. 40% of the colony's population is now showing symptoms depression, hallucinations, more violence. People are dying down there. I know it's linked to the marker somehow, but I just don't have enough data. Or, sir, maybe I was wrong. We need answers by any means possible. That patient, Brent Harris, might be our last hope. Crap, I use a thing on accident. I think I used a medium health thing on accident to heal myself. No, I didn't. We're good. Not sure what that used up. Hopefully a small health thing. I keep saying health potion. It's not a health potion, I know. It's just a healing item, whatever. You know what I mean? Where'd my... There it is. Okay, despite some some bad encounters there, we did okay. Let's go to the morgue. Okay. So yeah, surely the morgue's not going to be a great place.
any plenty things around here I can use. Just, you know, making sure. Should I use a stasis thing? We got two. I have more back stored there too. Text file. Medical log from Dr. G. Domus, medical examiner. Report of death on ship. Captain Matthias. It's my unfortunate duty to officially pronounce Captain Benj Benjamin Matthias dead. Reports of the exact circumstances surrounding his death are conflicted and will be left for investigators to determine once we return to port. I will constrain my comments to the condition of the body. Subject was in generally good health for his age, though a cursory blood test indicates his leukocyte count was very low, with eosinophils in particular almost non-existent. His pre-flight physical exam showed no such problems, indicating rapid onset, but it does not appear to have had any effect on his death. Multiple contusions on the arms and hands indicate a brief struggle pre-mortem. Light contusions around the rib cage indicate he was restrained, likely for a brief period. Cause of death was a single prolonged trauma to the ocular body which continued on through the cavity wall and into the frontal lobe, causing a rapid neurotrauma, seizure, and death. So a single hit to the ocular body, to the eyes area? Yeah, so... A very hard hit to the head. The angle of penetration into the ocular cavity indicates the injury was not self-inflicted. Examination required the removal of the object to confirm cause of death, but it has been preserved for the investigation team to study. I therefore have no alternative but to record a preliminary verdict of unnatural death, whether deliberate or accidental, is beyond my jurisdiction. Something got shoved through his eyeball. Hey, I was, I was taking that. Dead yet? Die already. Jesus. Took that much damage from that. Use this one too. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god, no, run. Run, come on, run. Other weapon.
die for fuck's sake. My god, why was it so tanky? Jesus. I have like no health stuff left. That was a very bad time to realize I was out of ammo. That guy was ridiculously tanky, holy crap. And no spiky things to use. Well, there's the rig, I guess. So now we're good. What's your status? Do you have the captain's rig? Fuck me! Ugh. Transmitting codes now. I saw it, Hammond. A flying one turned the captain's body into a, another one of those things. The same must have happened to Chen. God. Maybe the command computer has something. Uh, where's Daniels when you need her? Head back to the security checkpoint. It's safer there. At least I can upgrade your clearance. <sighs> okay. Oh, security clearance level one. Nice. Weren't there some over here that were level one? Like back over here? Oh, right over here, yeah. I could really, really use um, some health items. That goes back up. All right. And some more plasma cutter stuff, because this gun is not upgraded at all. It's not really great. Clearance confirmed. So is it worth going back through, or do I wait until I have clearance level two? Oh no. Isaac. I'm here. What the hell's happening? The computer says the Ishimura's engines are offline. We're on a decaying orbit toward Aegis 7. Oh god. I have to get to engineering. There's no time. That tram station's offline. Unless. Here. Head back to the flight deck. I'll guide you from there. If this damage report's right, there's a shortcut to engineering. Your hallway, A. Eh? Right, we went through here already. I need a store for storage. Get out some healing items. Clearance confirmed. Oh, nice. Clearance confirmed. Oh, thank goodness. All right, that works. Gotta remember to look out for the yellow ones. So they don't turn blue immediately. They're still gonna be yellow. I'll need to remember to check for them then. So we couldn't go over here before. This is where we came to from, right? Yeah, so this is where we came from. That's why we couldn't get there before, because it loops back around. Okay, we're back in the clinic. Um... A note here? Did I not see this before? Clearance. Oh, it's it through the clearance. Nice. So we get a free node there now as well. We couldn't get it before. Excellent. All died. Not all dead, but all died. This symbol of the marker. Okay, and this is, we're back now. Okay, good. We have a store back here, as well as a save point and other stuff, too. Good, good, good. Yeah, I'm curious if it's worth going back through the old areas, or if we're gonna end up just 
having so many enemies to fight back there that it won't be worth my time to go back through there, you know? Okay, I want some more health items for sure. I'm pretty sure I stored some... Plus, is there anything I want to sell? Uh, this thing, yeah. We actually have quite a bit of stuff we can sell. This is the cartridge rack. Bring this part to the bench to extend the upgrade path and gain access to special upgrades. For the, it's for the plasma cutter. Okay. I think it's always going to be the plasma cutter thing that it upgrades then. Wish there was a bench here. Oh yeah, we have a couple of these. Okay, cool. So I'm going to take uh, this and this. So this is the old one. Can I not like get rid of these then? Suit level one. I mean, I'm currently on suit level two, right? I, I'm, I'm pretty sure that's what that... I'm, I'm just not sure why we have that in my storage, though. Can I not get rid of these? Like, why do we have these here? I guess I could... Re-equip them? I'm not sure why I'd want to. I'll take this back as well. So I'm out of them now. Okay. Maybe move one of these over. Alright. Could use one, I guess, right now. Probably should just go ahead and use one, but I feel like I'll end up... I'll end up... finding one, and then I will be sad that I, that I used it, you know? Oh, right, we can do this now. Oh, it's level two. But there are some level ones we could check out. I don't know, do I want to go through areas again? And have to potentially fight enemies that spawn there again? I'm not sure it's worth it. Do we go on now? What's the objective now? Go to the hangar bay. Are we just going to like go to the next area now? Excuse me. Yeah, I think we just go now. Uh, but again, is it worth going back and going through some areas to get into some areas that are locked before? How do I change the floor? There is definitely stuff I missed that I could go back and get because I didn't have a security clearance for it. I'm just not sure if it's worth it now. Maybe I'll wait until I have security clearance too and then go back through and do everything. Okay, so we can select where we want to go. So I can go back to the hangar. I guess we're supposed to go there anyway. I'm just curious if I want to go back through these areas of medical and look for stuff I couldn't I couldn't open before. Is it worth my time or not? It might be. I mean maybe. Not move this. Okay. 
Can I get back through here now? I guess we can, just barely. Yeah, so now like I can go through here, right? So like there's gonna be stuff in here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It seems worth it to come back through. I mean, we had to use some ammo, but... I'd say that's worth it. It actually hurts them all that much. Kind of doubt it. Pretty much out of ammo for this thing. Definitely more of them up there. But again, it might be worth going up. Still can't go over here. There wasn't anything more over here, right? No, not those but I need I need a pointy body part. All these body parts suck. There we go. That'll do. Okay, I guess we're good. There are definitely a bunch of them in the, um the starting area right like the flight lounge area should be a bunch no open it up please Hmm. 
Yep, I remember that happening. Weren't there some things I couldn't open though around here somewhere? I thought there were some in here. Maybe not. Kind of hate that, that we have to wait for it to come back on. That's not creepy or anything. Where did where did my pointy bit go? I want it. I want it back. I dropped it somewhere. That's it. That'll work. That's secured to level two, I think. I can't go through there, right? Yeah, I can't do that yet. Or it's just locked, I guess. Main hangar bay is back here. Okay. No real point to coming back here. Tram station, though. Well, this... I think we're just good to go ahead and go now, I think. Like, there's no real reason to stick around here. Okay. I'm pretty sure I lost my pointy bit. Well, that one area was worth coming back to, though. We got a whole bunch of stuff in there. Okay, so what's the objective now? Where? Oh, we do go back this way. Okay. Go to the hangar bay. Oh, we are going back to the hangar bay. All right. I, maybe I was going the right way the whole time. I just didn't realize it. I was just looking around for stuff that I had security clearance for now that I didn't have before. Go ahead and use some stasis, maybe. Wait, where? This way. Okay. This damage report says there's a broken cargo lift just beyond the hangar doors. I'll open them now. Entering zero gravity. Oh. Well, at least we... You'll need your thrusters to reach it, but that lift shaft should take you straight down to engineering. This is totally new then. That's, uh... I don't remember doing this in the original. And we've got explodey things everywhere over here, which is great. It's much easier to explore this way. As cool as Zero-G is, it's much easier to orient yourself like this. I imagine Zero-G is probably very disorienting to be in. What do we get? I can't get them. They're floating. Here we go. 
Do I have to take off to get it properly? There we go. Okay, where's the... Uh, over here. The loading shutter. Oh, this giant thing over here. Nice. Loot. Oh, lots of loot. Many, many loot. Nice. They all float away, though. I guess you can do this. That makes sense. Security clearance stuff here. Level, Level three. three. Security clearance required. Better be something amazing to come all the way back here for that one security clearance thing. I'm glad there's oxygen in here. That'd be a real pain if you had to worry about O2 at the same time as you're doing all this stuff. There's so many explodey things in here. It makes me think, uh... We're going to have a pretty big fight here at some point. There's all these vents that they could pop out of, too. I think things will turn very bad in here at some point. Especially since we're getting all this free loot, you know? Such a big area, and since it's all like explorable in every direction, I'm just like scratching the surface down here. There's gonna be like lots more I can do up on top. Who knows? Poor Isaac, he's getting a workout. Okay, so I should probably turn the power thing to over here and it'll turn lifts on and stuff over here. Track control, switch tracks. Track control, switch tracks. There's like three of these and I don't know which, what I'm doing when I do this. Am I trying to move them out of the way? So let's go down here. Over there. What does this do? Oh. Can I kinesis these? So that was incorrectly aligned. I feel like I should take those off of there. Yeah, this is like incorrectly aligned. Okay.
So I can make us into a straight line. What's the purpose of that, though? What, is, what does it do? What does it do for us? Can I push this or something with a, uh, is there a button to push it? I just want to know what the point is. Hmm, more loot on here on the other side. I won't say no to that. So much loot here, man. It's great. Didn't exist in the uh, original game, you know? Semiconductor, very nice. My gosh, I must have a mutt bunch of ammo now. Three hundred, yeah, for this thing. Holy crap. The extremely small FOV makes this like really disorienting. I wish it was bigger, but there's no adjustment for that. And it was done on purpose to make it very disorienting feeling. You can roll, I guess, if you want to. Yeah, just roll like this. Man, that, like... I don't like it, guys. <laughs> I don't like it. It gives me a bit of uh, dizziness and vertigo and stuff, and it, it does things to my, my simple brain. I don't think I'd do well as a fighter pilot, even though that was my ambition when I was a little kid. I wanted to be a fighter pilot. I thought it'd be amazing, but... Uh, yeah, fly, fly jets and stuff, I thought that'd be really cool. Okay, well, we gotta go this way, right? Yeah. Reach engineer, engineering deck, okay. I'm still not sure what the purpose of turning these things is. Like what it will what it will accomplish to turn everything. I tried turning all these and it didn't really change anything. Maybe it'll come into play later on. You'd think I'd be able to like move something, you know? Like I'd be able to move an item out on the tracks and then I could do something because of that. This is still three, right? Yeah, I can't do I can't do this one. Or like kinesis them or something, but I, I can't. I can't do anything with this. So I'm not sure what the point of it is. Even more stuff up here.
Not a lot, though. My god, I can't I can't tell where I am. There we go. It got like okay, there we go. It got like extremely dark back there for some reason. A little bit of a bug there on the lighting. Oh, okay, so I can turn this on or off. Exiting zero gravity. Hmm. But I can't do anything right now, at least, with this. Kind of have to be in zero G to get off of here and get move off this little area. So doesn't really change anything. This is like glass, right? I can't go past this. Yeah, it's glass. It's all crystallized ice on the outside. Because it's space, it's cold in space. I think I've gotten the stuff. Can I go through here? Okay, this is the actual vacuum. I can just go back if I need to. I think I'll explore this area a little bit before I move on. Because I can just go back in over there if I need to and get more air. Make sure I haven't lost anything. Or have, I'm not missing anything important, you know? Okay, we'll go back for a second, get some air. I see some loot over there. Possibly a node here. Volker's rig. Oh, it's an O2 thing here. Whoa! I didn't yet even know you were there. Are there multiple? Any explodey things I can grab? So I have to use all my ammo up? Two for one there. Be nice if I did. Ah, no, I didn't. Who the hell else is there? There he is. Got him. Get out of here. Exiting 
Let's use a small one up for now. I want another explodey thing though. I realize I can't really go where I need to go because I don't have the air for it if I keep going slow like this. I just want to have this out here in case I need it. Should go back now. Oh God, that kind of scares me. This is giving me Subnautica vibes. I don't like it. I don't like it. Go, Isaac. You're good. You're fine. You've got time. Where am I going? Over there, okay. Going that way, maybe I should enter in over here. There's an O2 thing over here. Just right over here. Give me a piece of crap. Take that, stupid baby. I go up, please. Thank you. Okay. Uh, so... Ah! I think I hurt myself with that explosion a little bit. Okay, get recharged, then we go. The hell is this? I don't know about this, guys. I'm a bit concerned about the air. This is the scariest part of the game so far for me. Is the uh, lack of oxygen. Alright. Big gulp, Isaac, and let's go. Oh, guys, is this it? Please let this be it. Exiting zero gravity. Oh, good. I'm pretty sure it is. Exiting vacuum. Okay. That's not that bad, then. Bulls. It's like an entire clip to kill these things with this pulse gun. Clearance confirmed.
We are not punished for our sins, but by them. No, not for our sins, but by them. There's a fellow engineer. I really prefer to use this thing. Seems to work way better. I still think that's the case. Like, I still think this... Even though, like, I've realized I've upgraded this one, so that's kind of why. I still feel like... It's way better. Oh, I guess. Go ahead and use it. Using up my health stuff all left and right. Okay, is there anything else over here real quick? Because I know that I can get out of here now. Come on, can I get out? Entering zero gravity. Now that I know where the thing is at, I'm not so worried about oxygen. I can look around a bit more here. I don't think there's anything else here, though. God, that's so disorienting. Yes, get back in. Exiting zero gravity. Exiting vacuum. Not worth, man. Not worth. God, that gave me anxiety. I don't like it. Let's read a nice little text log here. Engineering log, Danvers. Organic growth and engineering. Yeah, we've seen that, haven't we? Adding this to my maintenance priority request, maybe something in writing will make them pay attention. That unidentified growth reported elsewhere on the ship has reached engineering. Not even medical knows what the hell is this stuff is. It looks like someone threw their guts up all over the walls and smells about the same. It's spreading faster than we can kite up, which is pretty disgusting in itself. It's already busting the cargo lift, busted the car cargo lift, and it's getting into the engine spoke. If we can't find a way to stop it soon, it'll be all over the main engine chamber by the day after tomorrow. Meantime, I'm heading to, into the mining decks. They've got PFM 100s in storage for ice mining, and they can spare the fuel. Maybe cauterizing this stuff will do the trick. Just hope it doesn't smell worse when it's on fire. Hmm. Foreshadowing about getting a new weapon, perhaps? I remember there being a flamethrower, and it wasn't very good. Though it might be more of a specialized weapon that you use for certain things, I don't know. Warning. Orbital position compromised. Correct course immediately. Okay, what's over here though, real quick? What is this? Engineering tram station. Equipment. Uh, let's see. Okay, so we can leave from here? We can... So once we unlock this, it allows us to fast travel back and forth from and to here. But before that, you can't do it. I see what that's what the point station of that is. I see. Accessible. Thank you for your patience. You had to like unlock the lockdown basically and now you can travel back and forth through areas I see okay got a save station probably got a place we can sell at yeah we got a store over here okay that may be enough excitement for me for one day playing this. 
zero G section kind of kind of scared the crap out of me. Yeah, I think we'll take a little break.